Hi, I'm Peter Askim, and I'm the conductor of the NC State Raleigh Civic Orchestras. And one of the things that we really embrace is the idea of the new, of the experimental, of the innovative. For the last seven years, on every single concert, we've done a world premiere commission. So we've asked composers to write music specifically for these orchestras that we then bring to life with a world premiere. When the pandemic hit, we decided to lean into this idea of innovation. Rather than trying to recreate music that was written for a different time and a different circumstance, we worked with nine living composers to create new works, each with its own approach to the central challenge of the pandemic, which is how do we keep performers performing and creators creating and composers composing while keeping everybody safe and everybody at a distance? How do we deal with the issues of latency and technology and distance to create something which is new and innovative and specific to our time? So each one of these composers had their own approach to solving this problem and their own individual voice through music. You'll hear three of those in this program. So the first composer you'll hear tonight is Nare Sol. She's an amazing pianist and composer and educator and YouTube sensation. She approached this idea of how do we keep composers composing and performers performing through video and through visual aids. So with her collaborator, Ben Levin, she created two short videos that you'll see tonight, Webbings and Circles, and had each of the musicians performing simultaneously. We were all playing at the same time, but they captured their sound at home. So they were performing while recording their sound. Then they sent it to Nare. She combined it into these amazing, mysterious, incredibly textured pieces of music that you'll hear tonight. Truly extraordinary. The second composer that you'll hear tonight is Trevor New. Trevor's a violist and composer and technologist who's really embraced the idea of distance collaboration in the pandemic. So rather than running away from the challenges of technology and latency, he's really made them a part of his music. They're a feature, not a bug. So this music that you'll hear tonight, Echoes from Our Digital World, was created for this orchestra simultaneously playing over clean feed. So this is a platform that creates a virtual room where everybody joins um, with their audio and then playing in real time together with latency in music that was designed for this specific situation. Um, it's really extraordinary when you see everybody playing together. It really happened. The culmination of all this was an incredible performance that Trevor did with the orchestra live in New York City. So Trevor was part of something called the Kaufman Music Center Musical Storefronts, performing on Broadway in a storefront for an audience gathered on the sidewalk outside. And the, uh, the orchestra joined him live and in real time, accompanying him for this live audience in New York, 30 musicians playing all together over hundreds and hundreds of miles. It was really an amazing uh, experience for everybody involved, musicians and Trevor and me and the audience. And it just really showed what happened if you really embrace the challenge of our time. The third piece that you'll hear tonight is by Milad Yousafi called Freedom. And Milad is a beautiful pianist and composer from Afghanistan. He wrote this piece uh, kind of chronicling his own journey and his own experience in his native land of Afghanistan. The way that this piece was created, uh, this recording, was that each musician recorded to a click track and a guide track at home individually all alone and then sent it in and we stitched it all together to create an incredibly powerful performance. Um, you can hear the passion of all of these musicians at home really wanting to collaborate, really wanting to create together. And you can sense the, uh, the sweep and the power of this music. And I know that you'll really be swept away by it. So I'm so glad that you could all join us and watch these incredible 
experiments in distance collaboration, uh, kind of fearlessly going into the challenges that we all face together. And I couldn't be happier uh, with all of the work that the musicians have done, that the composers have contributed, and that we can share with you through all of this. So please enjoy this brand new music, World Premieres. My name is Nari Sol. I'd love to introduce my pieces and share with you all a little bit about the process of putting all of this together. There are two miniatures. One is called Circles and the other is called Webbings. And they both draw from similar sources of inspiration. One being visuals provided by my friend Ben Levin who animated a lot of abstract lines and shapes and images related to things like water and waves and, and different shapes. Um, also, I have been influenced by pointillism, how many different dots or many different strokes can come together and create a different texture and a larger image. And I really leaned into these concepts because they really fit the set of circumstances we were all in, in terms of how we were going to put this together. We were all working virtually, we were all remote, therefore, the communication, although Zoom meetings are quite effective, there is always a delay. Everyone is not experiencing rehearsals collectively. We decided to record all the parts separately and no one was able to really experience playing with each other until afterwards. So there is this delay and also I needed to find room to just embrace the individuality of each member but also bring it together in a way that makes sense as a whole. So a lot of these concepts I communicated openly with all of the musicians and the piece itself morphed from rehearsal to rehearsal and from version to version. We also experimented with different forms of notation and different amounts of freedom given to the musicians in terms of how much they are able to improvise in what way they're improvising and how much choice they have. So with all of this being in the picture, uh, I felt that we were able to experiment with things that are not really practical in the traditional settings of working with an orchestra. And in that way, I felt that we were just really able to embrace our set of unique circumstances and um, still be able to create unique and meaningful and beautiful music. And I thank everyone for participating and being open, um, open-minded about all of this. I hope you enjoy.
Hi, uh, my name is Trevor New, and um, I'm the composer of Echoes from Our Digital World. Um, I want to thank uh, Peter and the Raleigh Sip Chamber Orchestra for putting this together. Um, it's really been a really, really great experience uh, getting to work with you, and and I really appreciate the willingness to try something extremely, extremely new. I'd say a little bit even, you know, beyond just saying experimentation. This is a, uh, this is, I would say, a first iteration of anything like this being done, to my knowledge, with uh, with these techniques. Um, yeah, echoes, uh, echoes from our digital world kind of details this uh, exploration that. I so I feel like I sort of went through as I was trying to figure out how to play with other people uh, using using the internet essentially. Um, there are networks all around us, like through our phones and our computers, um, wired and also through the air. And there are characteristics to all of those different devices and microphones and even the pathways that they operate in. Uh, so this piece kind of takes advantage of all of those things and what's really kind of cool just from a sonic perspective is we're not only hearing all of our instruments together in real time in this uh, recording but we're also getting to hear the sounds of everybody's homes kind of being melded together uh, we think of that as like the everybody's different room tones um, also coming together and it almost like we're existing not just in like a virtual space but in in many real spaces kind of at the same time um, and I really find that I, it's a really kind of thrilling experience on on my end to uh, to be a part of that uh, so yeah I want to say thanks again for <laughs> you know being willing to try all of these things out and uh and I'm really happy that we were also able to do a live performance of this piece. Uh, it's a, a telematic, a live telematic performance of this piece um, across from Lincoln Center. And uh, that I, I'm pretty sure has not been been done that way. Uh, and it it was a, a really amazing experience. Thank uh, thank you to all of you who were able to to be there and participate. And um, yeah, really, really thankful to be working with all of you. Please uh, enjoy uh, Echoes from Our Digital World.
Hello everyone, my name is Mila Yusufi. I am a pianist, composer, conductor and visual artist. I am a refugee from Afghanistan. I came to the US in 2015 and applied for political asylum and I have been living in New York City since then. Freedom is a very important piece for me because I wrote this piece uh, in my second year in the United States as a refugee and it was commissioned by New York Philharmonic Chamber Orchestra which was a very important and big thing and meaningful for me. In freedom, I wanted to express my feeling as a refugee and I wanted to become voice of other refugees. And there's my artwork that I did recently, um, which represents my heritage culture and my inner feeling as a refugee and what refugees go through emotionally and mentally. And um, I'm very p privileged to be witnessing the world premiere of the Chamber Orchestra version written for the North Carolina State Riley Civic Chamber Orchestra and I'm hoping you all like it. Thank you very much.